Well, good afternoon. It must be three o'clock because we're having something happening here at San Pedro. And today we're, we continue dealing with saints of hope and healing. And the two saints that I'm going to mention today are Saints Cosmos and Damien. And I'd like us to begin with prayer. And I'll be using the collect for that, their feast day, as well as a part of the collect, which is the prayer after communion on their feast day. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. May you be magnified, O Lord, by the revered memory of your saints Cosmos and Damien. For with providence beyond words, you have conferred on them everlasting glory and on us your unfailing help. Through our Lord Jesus Christ, your Son, who lives and reigns with you in the unity of the Holy Spirit, one God forever and ever. Amen. To most of you, these two names are very strange. And so you may be wondering, why are we talking about Cosmos and Damien? Who are they? And so maybe I could ask you, have you ever heard their names before? And so I believe that if you have been paying close attention to the Eucharistic prayer that we have been using here at St. Pedro during the whole during Easter week, then you would have heard those names. Because during Easter week, we have been using the Eucharistic prayer number one, popularly known as the Roman Canon. And in a section of the prayer that says, in communion with those whose memory we venerate, especially the glories of our Virgin Mary, and we mention the name of Saint Joseph, and we give a long list of saints. And the saints whose names we list are apostles as well as popes. And the last two names that are called Cosmos and Damien. Cosmos and Damien. And we conclude the section by saying, we ask that through their merits and prayers, in all things, we may be defended by your protecting help. So who are these two men? Cosmos and Damien were brothers. And they were not just brothers, they were twin brothers. And the church celebrates their feast day on the 26th of September. These two brothers, these twin brothers, they were doctors, physicians, and they're venerated as miracle workers in the restoration of health. What is so important about these two is that we're told that they never asked for any payment for their work. So if they lived in today's world, they wouldn't be asking for medical insurance. They would never accept payment for their services. For them, their profession as physicians, it was a ministry. They ministered by bringing about healing for their people. These two brothers, they were imprisoned because they were Christians. And so they were imprisoned during the persecution of all Christians by the Emperor Diocletian. They 
were tortured and they were beheaded in the year 303. And ever since that time, and even before they died, people recognize them as true holy men. And because of all of their miracle working, quickly people came to venerate them after their death. And so churches were named in their honor. And maybe the most famous church that exists is that basilica in Rome the Basilica of St. Cosmos and Damien. And just as a little bit of trivia, that is where the general courier of the Third Order Regular Franciscans can be found at the Basilica of Cosmos and Damien. So as we put them forward as saints of hope and healing, we think about this time of the pandemic that we're going through. Because Cosmos and Damien, they were invoked against all plagues. And therefore, it would be good for us during this time to call upon Cosmos and Damien and ask them to be with us as we undergo this current pandemic. And so it is very interesting that the, the prayer after communion that is used on their feast day, it says, preserve us in your gift, O Lord, as we commemorate the martyrs, saints Cosmos and Damien. Bring us healing, salvation, and peace. Bring us healing, salvation and peace and so as we think of these two men these two brothers these twin brothers these physicians we pray that through their intercession God will bring us healing salvation and peace during this time so yes we hold them up as saints of hope and healing. Saints Cosmos and Damien, pray for us. Thank you and God bless you.